interesting to see what comes from the camp if he is in fact dealing with an injury. Japan. Here is Shoma Uno. And here is the dark horse we were talking about, the 17 year old from Japan. National Junior Champion of Japan in 2015, also the World Junior Champion. And he started his season with a great win at uh, the, the Japan Open, beating world champion Javier Fernandez. So that's not a bad way to get going, is it? Rarely you, you find a skater that lands his jump with more speed than he went into those jumps itself. He's one of those. Very deep knee bend. Getting speed for the first quad. The amount of air time he has on his jumps when they're good is incredible. Sorry, but this, <laughs> this does it for me. The deep knee bend on the landing, keeping that speed up. Comes the other triple axle. Oh, triple two. Oh. So much air time, like we said. And he's got entirely the opposite approach to, to say, Jason Brown. He's keeping the entry simple, but he's getting it done. Get it done. Didn't like me enough. I'll 
give you that. I thought Andy was going to say, I also did that yesterday. <laughs> Let's not push it now. Well, the dark horse did not disappoint. Mm -hmm. Incredible performance by the 17-year-old, and in fact, Skate America has been very good to the men from Japan. They've won gold here the last three years. In fact, the last 10 years, the Japanese men have eight gold from Skate America. Well, you know, it's because the men from Japan are good to skating. They're all fabulous. They've all got that incredible ease across the ice. He looked like he could do that whole program again. Well, you brought, no a, you, you brought a good point with, you know, his entry to the jumps. If you want to have a steady edge mm. on the way out, you got to have a steady edge on Look the way in. Ice coverage. I'm going to sound like Don Cherry, but kids, if you're listening, <laughs> you've got to have your edge steady. Yeah, absolutely true. Solid. And patient. Do you think it's going to be a good battle as well with only two world spots available oh to the my. Japanese men and you've oh my. got quite the competitors? The scores, it's going to be a dogfight. Showa Uno from Japan has earned for his free skate program 176.65, <laughs> which is a new season's best. And there you go. Competitions for Game on, people. <laughs> He will sit in the top spot for now. Two more. Oh. Oh. Shivers. <laughs> I'm sorry, but this, this does it for me. The deep knee bend on the landing, keeping that speed up. Triple axle, oh, triple toe. So much air time, like you said. And he's got entirely the opposite approach to, for say, Jason Brown. He's keeping the entry simple, but he's getting it done. Get it done. That's it. performance by the 17 year old and in fact skate america has been very good to the men from japan they've won gold here the last three years in fact the last 10 years the japanese men have eight gold from skate america well you know it's because the men from japan are good to skating they're all fabulous they've all got that incredible ease across the ice he looked like he could do that whole program again well, you brought, no a, you, you brought a good point with, you know, his entry into the jumps. If you want to have a steady edge mm. on the way out, you got to have a steady edge on Look the way in. Ice coverage. I'm going to sound like Don Cherry, but kids, if you're listening, <laughs> you've got to have your edge steady. Yeah, absolutely true. Solid. The meat, the triple loop, <laughs> I kind of, the veggies, the potatoes, <laughs> I've 
do you need them He's in your got the whole salad bar He's got <laughs> just not beautiful triple psycho. Those are the kind of jumps, you know, you can't do perfectly. You don't want to leave any point on the table by missing those easier jumps. Taking a little breather here. He's going to go right into his second quad. see what comes from the camp if he is in fact dealing with an injury. Japan, here is Shoma Uno. And here is the dark horse we were talking about, the 17 year old from Japan. National Junior Champion of Japan in 2015, also the World Junior Champion. And he started his season with a great win at uh, the, the Japan Open, beating world champion Javier Fernandez. So that's not a bad way to get going, is it? Rarely you, you find a skater that lands his jump with more speed than he went into those jumps itself. He's one of those. Speed for the first quad. The amount of air time he has on his jumps when they're good is incredible. skater who's fit, trained, and ready, and it's a completely different story. And that level of fitness basically gives him a 10% increase on the base value of that quad because it's done in the second half of the program. Exactly. Ah, to be young again. Oh, I just did that yesterday. What are you talking about? <laughs> gaining speed at the end of the program, which is incredible. And he's patient. He's patient on the jump entries, which, which is what I love. He takes his time and doesn't rush, and that's why they're coming out so nicely. 